The popular pumpkin patch is named in a million dollar lawsuit. This comes two years after a couple says they suffered multiple injuries after a train crashed on the property. Good afternoon. Thanks so much for joining us for K2 News at 4. I'm Deborah Knapp. And I'm Ray Gasway. The lawsuit accuses Hoffman Farms of knowing their train ride had issues and still allowing people to ride on it. K2 Shelby Slaughter joins us live now from Portland. Shelby, this couple's grandchild was riding in their laps. Yeah, so think about it this way, right? You have two grandparents on a ride with the grandchild on the grandpa's lap. And when the ride tipped over, the grandpa tried to shield their grandchild. But in the end, the lawsuit doesn't say anything about the grandchild, but the, both the grandparents did sustain injuries. A train ride gone wrong. Now, one family wants Hoffman Farms, located in Beaverton, to pay. According to a newly filed lawsuit, a couple is seeking $1.3 million after suffering injuries from a train ride while visiting the pumpkin patch. The lawsuit saying the owners were negligent in operating the train that knowingly had issues after it tipped over with the couple and their grandchild on it saying, quote, the train in question would derail from time to time. And, quote, this accident caused injuries to plaintiffs Kevin Burns and Deanne Burns. The farm's website giving a glimpse of the Hoffman Farms Express, charging $5 per ticket. Infants under one can ride on laps. I reached out to the family's lawyer for an interview. That was declined. Instead, their lawyer sent over the police report from the 2022 incident. And I did reach out to the family that owns Hoffman Farms. I was told that they were going to send over a statement to me. And as of just now, I have still not received anything. Reporting live in Portland, I'm Shelby Slaughter, K2 News. Shelby, thank you for that.